I first would have them take a look at the dirt road. At this time, Philadelphia uh, doesn't have any paved roads, so you see the cloud of dust that's being kicked up on the parade route here on Chestnut Street. What we are witnessing is the Rhode Island Regiment moving through Philadelphia on September 2nd, 1781, as they link with the Continental Army marching towards Yorktown. Uh, it's a city scene, a uh, parade, a festive atmosphere, but right in the middle is 15-year-old James Fortin, who so it just so happens to be his birthday as well, is also observing this parade. My name is Michael Idris, and I am the African American Interpretive Fellow here at the Museum of the American Revolution. I think Fortin would have had a great sense of pride watching uh, men of African descent march through Philadelphia. Well, due to uh, Rhode Island having a small population, uh, they had challenges in finding soldiers that were able to fight. Uh, so uh, they found themselves needing the services of both free and enslaved people of African descent to participate. The members of the Rhode Island Regiment are wearing these hunting shirts, which was a distinctive characteristic of riflemen uh, during this period, people who were coming out of the Pennsylvania back country, as well as other spaces within the mid-Atlantic like Maryland and Virginia. So it's a very distinctive look. We don't have a lot of hunting shirts that are still remaining from the Revolutionary Era, and it is a, a, a clothing attire that was appropriated from a Native American dress. So James Fortin, he is wearing clothing that he would have purchased probably after his first tour on duty as a privateer. As a privateer, he would have been able to take part in the prize money from captured ships that he would have had the chance to encounter during his tour at sea. It was more difficult for black soldiers to receive their pensions. Often they would need uh, a, another uh, white soldier to vouch for their time of service. I want people to recognize that individuals of African descent have uh, participated in uh, all of the events in some capacity that led to the formation of this country.